So here is our first routine to help tone and strengthen the legs. So I've got a chair for support because some of these exercises require good balance. So if you're feeling a little wobbly or you know your balance isn't that great, mine's a little hit and miss. So um, I'm holding onto a chair so you can do the same if you want to. Okay, so we're going to start off with a little a leg warmer, a little hip warmer. Um, so we'll start there, shall we? So what I'm doing, I'm just standing. My, um, If you imagine, uh, we normally stand in Pilates with the feet hip width apart. I'm still doing that, but I've just turned out my toes a little bit. So they're more pointing into the corner of the room. So what I'm going to do now with this outside leg now, I'm just going to pick the knee up. OK, and you can see the knee goes over the toe. OK, I'm going to lift the foot. OK, now I want to keep the bend in the knee. I'm going to stand nice and tall, lengthening up through the spine, making sure I keep those abdominals nicely engaged. And then all I'm going to do is I'm going to swing the leg forwards and then I'm going to swing the leg back. So we swing it forwards and swing it back, swing it forwards and swing it back. Nice and slow, nice and controlled. Swing and swing. Trying to keep the rest of the body nice and still. So look straight ahead. The standing leg has got a little bend at the knee. Okay, shoulders are down. Nice control swing. Okay, so this time we'll uh, just change the rhythm a little bit. So we'll do a swing, a swing, and a hold the leg. Then we do a swing and a swing and hold the leg. Do a swing and a swing and hold the leg. Let's swing and swing and hold the leg. Wonderful. Let's bring the foot back down onto the floor. Okay, so this time I'm still gonna have my toes pointing outwards to pointing into the corner of the room, but I'm going to bring the heels together Mine aren't quite touching, there's a little gap there. Okay, that's okay. So do you want the feet in that sort of that V-shaped position now? So what we're going to do is a little bit of balancing. So this is where you might want to hold on again. Okay, belt on, standing up nice and tall, shoulders down. We're going to lift the heels. So as you breathe out, we're going to lift the heels up and back down. We lift them up and back down. So you want to lift the heels as much as you can. Okay, if you can lift a little bit, then that's okay. So we're really focusing on those calf muscles now. Okay, lift and lower. Lift and lower. A nice, slow and controlled lowering is what we're looking for. Okay. Now, we can keep the feet in this position and do a little knee bend this time. So we'll go down to the knees and stand tall. Down to the knees and stand tall. Down, stand tall. So as I bring my legs back to that starting position, I'm almost feel like I'm giving them a little squeeze together. Squeeze the legs, but I'm also squeezing my bum as well. Squeeze, okay? Because I want to work those leg muscles as much as possible. Okay, so it's a squeeze and bend. Squeeze the legs and bend. Wonderful. Shall we put the two together? So let's go into our heel lift. So let's do a lift and lower, bend and return. Lift and lower, bend and return. Wonderful. Let's add in a little pulse. Three pulses. One, two, three, and stand. Lift and lower. One, two, three, and stand. Lift and lower. One, two, three. Three, last time, lift and lower. One, two, three, and stand. Wonderful, okay. So let's separate the feet a little bit more then this time. So this time I've got my feet about shoulder width. I've still got the toes turned out so they're still pointing into the corner of the room. Hands still on the hip, abdominals are still engaged, shoulders are down nicely. Now can you do those heel lifts again? So keep the legs nice and straight. And then as you breathe out, lift the heels up and back down. Lift the heels up and back down. Now it's a little bit trickier when the feet are wider. So what I do is I imagine, you know those big beach balls, 
Okay, imagine you've got one of those between your knees, okay, and you need to squeeze that ball as you go up and as you come down. Okay, so that will get the legs working again, but it'll make you feel more stable. You'll, you won't feel as wobbly. Okay, breathe out. Let's lift and lower. Here we go. Last one, and then we'll go into some knee bends. So from here, we'll go down into the knees and stand tall. And again, we go down and stand tall. Go down and stand tall. Go down. Wonderful. So just a little knee bend. You don't need to go down too far. Here we go. We'll do one more and then we'll add in the heel lift. So here we go again. We'll do a lift and lower into the knees and stand. Let's lift and lower into the knees and stand. And again, wonderful. Don't forget to squeeze that beach ball as you lift the heels. Wonderful. Okay then. So it's time to add in those little pulses again. So we'll lift and lower. We'll pulse, two, three, and stand. Lift and lower. Let's pulse, two, three, and stand. Lift and lower. Pulse, two, three. Last one. Let's lift and lower. Pulse, two, three, and stand. Wonderful. Let's just do those bends into the knees again. So we'll go down to the knees and stand tall. Let's carry on with a few of these for a second. So what we're going to do this time is add in a little stretch. We're going to have a nice side of body stretch. So we'll do one more knee bend, and then this time we're going to take the arm up and over the top. See, I'm pointing that foot, and then I come all the way back down. So we go back into the knees and stand tall. Arm goes over, point the foot, and return. Go down to the knees and stand, reach and point, and lower. And again, down to the knees and stand, let's point. Last one, down to the knees and stand, reach, and return. Wonderful. So we've done an awful lot of work for the calf muscle, so let's have a little stretch before we do anything else. So I'm just holding onto the back of the chair now. I'm going to step with one foot. So this is the leg I'm going to be stretching. So we need to make sure it's nice and straight and the heel stays on the floor. So all I'm going to do now is bend that front knee, keep the heel on the floor, and you get that really nice stretch now into that calf muscle. Okay. So we'll just hold it there just for a few seconds. And then we can switch and we can do it on the other leg. So again, now straight leg. Heel stays down on the floor. Bend the front knee. Get that nice stretch again. So the muscles are nice and warm now. They're nice and pliable. So they, they're easier to stretch. Wonderful. Okay. Now we really need to do that on the other side. So I'm going to turn my chair around. And we're going to start again. Okay. So hands on the hip. Okay, so I'll stand with my feet hip points to start with again, shall I? Knees are soft, lengthening up through the spine again. The abdominals are engaged. I'm just going to turn the toes out. So toes are pointing into the corner of the room again. We're going to do the little leg swing again that we started with. So I'm just going to lift the knee. So you can see the knees going over the toes again. Look straight ahead. We're going to pick the foot up and then we're going to swing the leg forwards and swing the leg back. Swing the leg forward. Swing the leg back. So it's nice and controlled. That's it. Staying nice and upright through the upper part of the body again. Swing and swing. Nice little swing. That's it. Let's change the rhythm again. So we'll do a swing, swing, and hold the leg. Do a swing and a swing and hold the leg. Do a swing and a swing and hold the leg. Last one. Swing and swing and hold the leg. Wonderful. Bring that foot back down. So we're going to keep the toes turned out again. Only we're making the V shape, little V with the feet this time. Okay. So we're going to go back into our heel lifts again. Do the same sequence again. So here we go. We're going to breathe out. We're going to lift the heels and lower. Let's lift and lower. Lift and lower. Remember, nice straight legs. So as I lift my heels, I squeeze the front of my thighs together as well. 
wonderful into the knee bends so we go down and stand then lift and lower go down and stand and lift and lower and again go down and stand i think it's time for those pulses so here we go pulse two three and stand lift and lower let's pulse two three and stand lift and lower pulse two three and stand last one lower one two three stand tall wonderful okay feet are further apart this time so back shoulder width toes are still pointing out into the corner of the rooms okay beach ball time beach ball between the knees again we're going to see if we can lift those heels so here we go breathing out lift the heels up squeeze the legs together remember you've got that ball between the knees give it a nice squeeze that will help to stabilize you as you go up and again breathe out lift and low wonderful okay let's go into the knee bends again here we go we go down and stand let's lift and lower go down and stand let's lift and lower and again down and stand lift one more time and then on the next one we're going to add in the little pulses so here we go we'll pulse two three and stand let's lift and lower pulse two three and stand to lift and low. Let's keep squeezing that ball as you lift those heels. Here we go. Squeeze the ball. That's it. One more time. Pulse. Two. Three. And stand. Lift the heels. And lower. Fabulous. Okay. Back into the knees. Down to the knees. And stand tall. Down to the knees. And stand tall. We've got to add in that little stretch again, haven't we? Okay, so we'll do it after the next one. We'll go down one more time, and this time we're going to send the arm over the top. We straight the leg, point the foot, and come back. So we go down and stand, point out and reach, and return. Go down and stand, point out and reach, and return. Couple more. Go down and stand, point out and reach. Last one. Go down and stand point out reach wonderful we're going to do those stretches again okay so i'm holding onto the back of the chair again stand nice and close and then take one step back so remember this is the leg stretching so keep the heel flat on the floor bend that front leg and then you get that really nice stretch again into the calf muscle you might find it feels a little easier this time we'll just hold it for a few seconds and then we'll switch, we'll take the other one back. Nice little stretch through that calf muscle again. And then we can come back up. And then just give the legs a little shake to finish. 